Fire jumped containment lines and tore through the Flinders Chase National Park in all directions, triggering an emergency warning for the whole western half of Kangaroo Island. Regrettably, it hasn't disappointed. It has done exactly as we anticipated, much more quickly and more fiercely than we anticipated. This fire tornado shows the intensity of the conditions. The fire fanned by gusty winds and soaring temperatures. The National Park is home to the island's popular attractions, including remarkable rocks. But the island's mayor fears most of the National Park has now been burnt. North Coast has been, looks like it's been hit by a nuclear bomb. It's unclear whether the Flinders Chase Visitor Centre or the Western KI Caravan Park survived, with conditions still far too dangerous for assessment teams to enter. I will be astonished if homes are not lost by this fire. Staff at the luxurious Southern Ocean Lodge were forced to shelter as the ferocious blaze approached. Hundreds of tourists were evacuated in the days prior, but the Country Fire Service is warning some people ignored their warnings. It's disappointing to me to note that reports are coming back that some people did not heed the warnings to leave early. Extra firefighters and water bombers were called in as local firefighters battle fatigue and exhaustion on top of the fires. But not good. They are completely exhausted. So I feel for, sorry, I feel for the local ones. Uh, you know, there's some fresh ones that have come over. By late afternoon, the Duncan fire burning in the northern part of the island was contained. A relief centre has been set up at Kingscote, but authorities are now warning holidaymakers to avoid the island altogether. I'm bleeding for my community at the moment. They're exhausted. They're totally exhausted. And uh, it's really, really tough to keep cracking. The ravine fire has blackened 14,000 hectares, including parts of Shauna Black's timber plantation. There's a lot of plantation timber down there which belongs to us and also to independent growers. So there are a number of growers on the island who have already been impacted. Wind gusts of up to 55 kilometres an hour on the island have made fighting the fire incredibly difficult. Staff from the timber plantation are assisting more than 150 country fire service firefighters and farm firefighting units to bring this blaze under control as the milder conditions set in. This is fucked up. There is a fire in Kangaroo Island. Well, you be and it's even worse because it happened at the after beginning of New Year's 2020. What is what a day to s start after New Year's where everyone thinks something good would happen in that year. Well, no, it's terrible here. There's a fire. It, it, it's like a thousand degrees. Did you know that bad things happen every year? I, I made a video of this fire coming. I think I'm going to lose the house. This is very serious. Because there's a fire. I don't even know if it is still out there now. But it is a fire, and it's it's it killed two people, two people, two people die. Wow! Whoever celebrated New Year's are a disgrace, including what happened at the the tallest building in the world. <laughs> Are you fucking serious? Is that happy to you? What is wrong with you people there? Come on, do these people look happy to you about 2020? No, the fuck they're not. They're sad because of a fire. I I know what happened. I know what happened. What started the fire? What happened is the lightning struck. It was a. It was the same cloud that was at that place where they did the fireworks, where, where all the celebration happened, and then the fire. It was. It was too ang. The cloud was too angry, and they just struck at, at King Ground. Yeah, that's what happened. It was after me. That's right. The cloud knew that uh, he was going. The cloud was going after people that don't celebrate New Year's, and I was the one. Because, because every new year I feel like dying. Because this fire is a serious fire. Because it's, 
it's killing everyone. Everyone and people at the library were sad. Uh, I think that's where they were. No, I didn't be there. Oh, I could have been there. I could have been on the news if I was just there. No, never get any more. Yeah, I could have. I'm an idiot. I could have been. I could have been on the news. Uh, get it? That's the only views I got. Cause, cause now there's a fire. I don't know if it's coming here. Hopefully, it does not come here. Yeah. Yeah, that's it today. Cause now there's a fire. Nothing is watching. Let's see all. In the next video.